Yo, Ryan, it's your first hurricane. Hurricane? What a hurricane? Nobody goes through a hurricane with big hair. Are we evacuating? I think it's uh, too late, too early to tell. Yeah. <laughs> Good afternoon, everybody, and welcome to today's vlog. I am Jill, and this is It's the Donnellys. We are so happy that you're here. If you are new to our channel, please let us know in the comments that you are new to our channel, and all of our wonderful family members will say hi to you and welcome you to our community. If you have just subscribed, let us know that too, and we'll give you a wave. So we have an amazing community, and we are so happy to have you guys all here. And hopefully you'll enjoy yourself while you're here. If you haven't subscribed, click the subscribe button and uh, you'll be the first to know when new videos come out. Now this one is a doozy, you guys. Holy cow. All right. I um, have been, I was away last week in Maryland. We came back on Thursday night, left on Friday morning for Tallahassee to go to parents weekends. We were there Friday, Saturday, Sunday. And on our way up on Friday, I was working, working on my computer and um I got a text from my friend who lives in Orlando, my friend Kristen, and she's like, hey, just wanted to let you know, if you guys, you know, feel like you need to evacuate from the hurricane, you're welcome to come over to Orlando. And I'm like, hurricane? What a hurricane? I look at Mike, I look at Ryan, I'm like, is there a hurricane? They're like, yeah. Next thing I know, she points me to Facebook to like, all this stuff. There's a, there's a hurricane coming. Apparently there's a hurricane coming. I was none the wiser. So all weekend, I didn't really pay attention to it because we were at parents weekend, but I kept getting all of these notices from Ryan's school like, hey, we're going to keep you up to date. Looks like it's coming. Well, today, just now, I just got a communication from our um, neighborhood and a communication from the school saying that schools starting tomorrow are going to be closed. They are shutting down because our schools will be hurricane shelters. So this might be kind of a bigger deal than I thought it was going to be. Um... One thing I'll say is like when we lived in Maryland, we lived through a lot of hurricanes and being right on the water, not only were we on the water, our house, but it's, it was like, it was um, sea level, it was ground. Like maybe, I mean, it might've been up two feet, whatever. So we got a lot of floods. Fortunately, we ne it never flooded our house, but I mean, we had people canoeing through the front yard <laughs> like on multiple occasions during hurricanes or the after aftermath. So um, I think they play a little bit different down here in Florida. I think it's the hurricanes, well, they're more frequent and I think they might be bigger and badder. So Mike is out running some errands right now. I'm thinking I probably should go to the grocery store because I have no food in the house because we've been gone. Um, so I just kind of freaked out a little bit because it's sounding so, um, intense. So stay tuned. If you guys are in Florida, um, I'm not going to tell you what to do, but follow everybody's guidance. Mike is a bit of a storm chaser there, you guys, you know, so he's going to want to stay and watch. Um, I feel like we're inland enough that it won't be an issue, but there's going to be some winds and we're in a pretty sturdy, fairly new building built in 2012. So I think we should be okay, but I, I, I really don't know. So um, let us know what you think. I don't know, by the time you get this video, will we have already had the hurricane? We, it might be hurricane day, actually. It might be Thursday. All right, so I was taking a nap before I went to pick up. I like to take a nap and just like close my eyes for like 10 minutes. I can be out like that, 10 minutes, I'm up. We call it sleeping the top off, keep going. Anyway, I'm the one that took Ryan to school this morning, so I was up early, early, early. So I got woken up, Katie is coming home. They've closed FSU. So now she and Kaden are coming down. They're gonna be with us. And I'm going to pick up Ryan at the at the bus stop. Dad, Mike said there's huge lines at the gas station, so I'm gonna go wait in line with him, with with Ryan to get gas for the car. And, um, and then try to go to the grocery store and hopefully there's gonna be some food. I really don't know. But this hurricane thing is happening quickly. I right, got Ryan. Ryan, how'd it go in school? How did you find out that school is going to be closed? Uh, they're like, there's going to be a new weather update um, soon. And I was like, okay, so it's just showing history. And then um, the county next to us closed schools. And we were like, yeah, if they're closing schools tomorrow, there's no way we don't. So, and then. Wait, how did you know the county? Did, did they text you? Did it, your friends text no, you? No, no. There's another kid in class who was like, oh yeah, they just closed schools for tomorrow. And then you texted me. Oh my gosh. Okay, so um, we're gonna run to the Costco, I think, and try to get gas up there, and we're gonna get um, whatever groceries they've left. 
we won't take all of them obviously because other people need them too but right. what, what they have we'll just have to buy this happened when did this happen COVID. was it covid that's yeah. what it was when they closed schools for covid brendan and i went to the uh, sam's club and we were literally like we bought rice flour yeah and tuna fish that's all i had left yeah that was crazy mm -hmm. so hopefully we'll have a little bit more than that here for costco because yeah. it's not closing indefinitely it's just for a few days but if we're gonna have brennan which i hope brennan's coming back i'm not sure <laughs> we have brennan kaden katie ryan me and all dad the are back. all the homies no. lines at the gas station aren't too too bad that's our first order of business is getting gas mm -hmm. so not terrible we're at costco Mike said at the Wawa they were nuts. Yeah. He waited quite a bit of time, but we came to the Costco because I kind of think we need to get a lot of food because if we're having a lot of people come, well, not a lot of people, but right. you, Caden, and grill. Brennan eat a lot of food. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, we're doing pretty well with the groceries. You got three to the bottom, three on top. Great, we got some eggs, some croissants, we got some pork, cold pork, and we're gonna make some, um, where's the, oh, we're gonna make some chili. We can just eat, eat it. Yeah. If the power goes out, it doesn't matter, right? Yeah. yeah. So it is getting a little bit stormy out there, but I don't know, Mike, is that the same storm? I don't know, just to check. Wow. Is this the, the first sightings? I don't know, it might be. They might be just showing up. I think it is. All right, what's your hurricane plan? We went to the grocery store. We're gonna make cookies, but maybe, <laughs> maybe we're not making cookies. It's called hurricane cookies? Hurricane cookies. And Brennan and Katie and Katie were gonna come, but now it's up in the air about whether they're coming. Katie wants to stay there because he said it'd be a lot of fun having a hurricane with all his friends. Right. I understand um, that. Speaking of, having fun during the hurricane. Uh, I'm gonna go to Young Life, and then all the homies are gonna meet up. Uh, there's these uh, beach volleyball courts. We're gonna go play beach volleyball, and I think I'm going to Trevor's house tonight, after that. Why? Just sleep over, because the boys don't have school tomorrow. Oh. So we're all gonna go, and you bring a bathing suit, can't let me forget that. <laughs> and we're all gonna go. For the flood? Exactly. Nice. <laughs> we're gonna go swim. And so the hurricane isn't actually here yet, but we're trying to have fun because we don't have school and then we're going to fall out. And they've closed schools because they're using the schools for shelter. What is fall out? Fall out is just a phrase meaning do good. <laughs> just balling out. Having fun. Exactly. You, should, you know, usually a basketball term, fall out. Really? But you'd say Justin Herbert's balling right now. You'd be like, oh, look, he just, I'm just going to ball out. Um, back in my day, balling out was uh, crying. Oh, I'm not, I'm not gonna do any of that. But ball out <laughs> meaning like oh, I get it. Like yeah. we need to get a hair, hurricane haircut too. We're we'll do haircut. that tomorrow. Her yeah, yeah. Is that a good idea? We stop by hurricane. <laughs> Seeing as though you have a whole day tomorrow with nothing necessary that you have to be doing. No barber shops are open. Oh, I'm sure they're gonna be open. Well, Everybody has to get their hurricane haircut. Nobody goes through a hurricane with big hair. Is that a thing? Yeah. I, this is my first Florida hurricane. <laughs> and we never I'm did that in Maryland, but these things. <laughs> Tell Dad. Actually, it's required to get a crew cut. <laughs> no. Is it? Yes. <laughs> now um, he's taking it a little bit too far. Yeah, yeah. Hurricane, hurricane chase. When your uh, computer teacher walked into class today, what did he say? This is so funny. He goes, Yo, Ryan, it's your first hurricane. And I was like, yeah. <laughs> Who does have, he know? Because remember, they don't have snow days here. That's right. They have hurricane weeks. All about hurricane weeks. But little does he know Very that in Maryland we had a few hurricanes. But Mike, Ryan said he does not remember the hurricanes in Maryland. No. Isn't oh. that sad? Was he alive? Yes. Yes, he snuggled up in the bed in the guest bedroom with Katie and Brennan, remember? Oh, right. Lots of times. I wouldn't yeah. say snuggled. I'd say they more snuggled with me because they were scared. Right, um, right. I kind of kept the peace. No, mister, I can't stay in the basement if it's dark by myself up until you were like 12. You remember making pancakes <laughs> on the grill? No. <laughs> you Fish, fishing off the deck? <laughs> off the deck. Literally off the top deck. That's funny. Yeah. No, funny. I don't. Um, Mom. What? 
every kid knows once you turn off the lights in the basement, you sprint up the stairs. That's exactly. Except for kids in Florida, because y'all don't have they basements. Have, they, don't have, they don't know what it's like to be scared in the basement. Y'all don't have basements down here. Right, or freaked out of the basement. All right, Mike, what are our plans for the hurricane? We have, we have purchased food. We have mm -hmm. filled our cars with gas. Mm -hmm. We have extra water. What's next? Well. Are we evacuating? No. Okay. Nope. We're going to keep our heads. Do some smart stuff. Like what? Play little cards. Okay. Have some fun. Okay. Yeah. Are we gonna put the hurricane shutters up? Definitely. I think it's uh, too late, too early to tell. Okay. We're a little bit insulated here, uh, which I think is good. So. What uh, is the weather person saying? Dad is one of those dads <laughs> that always says the weather guy's wrong and he doesn't need directions when putting together stuff like that's the kind of daddy is which i love him and he usually works out pretty well i'm not gonna lie uh but you know for stuff like hurricanes i don't know i kind of believe him that it's not gonna be that bad because they're like it's gonna be insane but this is the thing like i said what i say to you today in the car a maryland hurricane might be completely different from a florida hurricane Go. do you know oh like this yeah just yeah. can you see me in there there we go yeah it's a little zoomed in Oh, sorry. Okay. Anyway, guys, uh, we didn't get many hurricanes in Maryland, so it's our first hurricane in Florida. We're nerve sighted for it, but uh, it's all going to work out. It's going to be great. No school, so that's fun for me. It's going to work out. It's going to be and... great. They're already evacuating coastal towns. <laughs> <laughs> we have done a few things. We, um, we've, we're um, making ice. The ice maker's making a lot of ice. So that's good, so we can keep things cool. We filled our. our Gas tanks with uh, gas, so that's good too. Uh, we got some food, that's good too, and some water. So I think. We'll... And you and you're um, charging up the generator. That's right. We're charging that up, making sure all of our phones are charged. You bought some batteries, which I think is a good idea. So we're doing all things that are prudent. Nothing mm -hmm. silly, right? Nothing dangerous, but right. um, yeah. There's a great scene in Jaws. Uh, the Jaws, the original Jaws, where all of the. Um, townspeople are going out to hunt for the shark. It's a great scene. If you ever get a chance to watch it, it shows all of the people going out to hunt for the shark. And it reminded me of the Home Depot today. <laughs> everyone was m running around doing stuff. I thought, oh, this is that scene. Yeah, okay. Look it up. <laughs> Excellent. All right, so you're, you're going to celebrate by going and going to Young Life and then playing volleyball and then sleeping over at your friends. And then tomorrow we're going to get a hurricane haircut. Correct. Pretty much, that's all we have left to do. For me, it was more like when they found Boo at Harryhausen's. <laughs> right. In Monsters, Inc. <laughs> right. That was kind of Costco today. I'm fine. Oh. That wasn't actually like that. I just thought of that scene when Dad said that scene. Anyway, guys, <laughs> right. um, stay tuned because this is going to be really fun. Because we like storms. We, we do. Storms. And we appreciate the the fact that there will probably they be, be dev bad. devastation and destruction. Right. right. Um, but if I mean, you do what you have to do, right? Do what you gotta do. Yeah. Uh, stay safe if there's yeah. ever a hurricane. And um, we're gonna see where this one takes us. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.